Next is the Exceptional Service Award. The Exceptional Service Award is given to students who have made substantial contributions of time, leadership, and energy for the benefit of their peers and the ENO organization as a whole. We have so many amazing and helpful students in this program. Trying to make this decision was extremely challenging. This year, I have selected seven students who have all these traits and have worked hard to better this program because they care so deeply about everyone. This year's recipients are Ryan White. Ryan is a natural leader, problem solver, and has been a fantastic assistant this year. He has put in a ton of work videoing all of our performances throughout the school year, then editing them to look amazing and posting them to YouTube for all to enjoy. The amount of work to do this is immense. The ENO is so lucky to have such a helpful, selfless, humble rock star making this possible. Ryan is always willing to help whenever I need. He has been the kind of student that solves problems and addresses issues before I even knew they existed. I have been blessed to have him in the program and so grateful for all his hard work. Kaylee Page. I'm not sure there is a student that is more naturally gifted in the desire to help others and give of her time than Kaylee Page. She has been working to help the ENO any way she can and without any regard to time. She does all this while staying so kind, sweet, and humble. Kaylee might be flying under your radar, but not mine. She's an incredible student. Paul Crawford. In terms of truly great leadership, Paul is one of the very first that come to my mind. He embodies all of what the ENO stands for. You, can, you can't lead others before you can lead yourself. He always has the orchestra's best interests at heart from the moment he enters the room. Then he puts all his energy into leading and helping those around him become better and stronger musicians and leaders themselves. I've been so proud of you, Paul. Chloe Buckner. I'm pretty sure Chloe has been in my office nearly every day this year and has asked if there's anything that needs to get done. Is there anything she can help with? She's the kindest heart and hugely reliable and helpful. She's an example of what friendship, service, and leadership should look like. Our symphonies, orchestra, concert master. She is always thinking about what she can do to aid her fellow musicians in order to make the orchestra stronger. I'm really going to miss her a bunch next year. Eli Bigler. Eli is a leader through and through. As a musician, the orchestra highly respects him for his talent on the cello, but also for his care of the whole ENO organization. He wants to graduate, leaving his section, orchestra, and school better than he found it. He is committed to all things he sets out to accomplish and brings all others with him. As a teacher aide in our string orchestra, he often looked for ways to help his younger peers grow at their chosen craft. We are all thankful Eli has been a member of our ENO. Me for sure. Rachel Smith. Rachel Smith without a doubt deserves this award. Exceptional, humble, leadership, energy, time. She is everything that embodies this award. Rachel has even given her money to help the program of her own volition. You don't have to ask Rachel if she's willing to help out. She is already doing it. I don't know anyone more perfect to receive this award. You're amazing, Rachel. I'm so proud of you. Last, not least, Jet Mizell. Jet is such a leader, but perhaps one that flies under the radar because he is so humble at the same time. Jet is always looking for ways that he can be there for you. Lend a helping hand or just be present for you during a challenging time. Jet is everyone's friend. He knows no stranger and everyone loves him right back. I've never heard anyone ever say a bad thing about Jet. 
When you think of Jet, I think the words that come to mind are kindness, joy, service, leadership, and passion. Thank you, Jet, for being such an amazing you.